first you pour the water. Then you add papaya leaves. Then you heat it up and drink it down. If only killing cancer was as simple as sipping tea. I really believe there's something to it. Uh, and uh, whether or not it's going to save my life, I don't know. Come and see me in five years. Linda Michael says it may be. She's battling aggressive ovarian cancer, which kills 15,000 women per year. Monthly chemo visits are just too much. I couldn't get out of bed. I couldn't get off the couch. So she's adding a new treatment to the mix, tea made from papaya leaves. I'm doing a lot better than my oncologist thought I was going to do. University of Florida physician Nam Dang has the science to back up Linda's new brew. We have found that there are components in tea extracts that actually kill the cancer cells directly. Dang found exposure to papaya leaf extracts slowed tumor growth in 10 types of cancer cells. It also boosts the immune system, where traditional chemo treatments make it weaker. That's the excitement behind what our finding is the fact that we may have a drug here that can do several things in fighting cancer. In other studies, mixing natural and standard medicine, University of Pennsylvania researchers found flax seed reduces heart disease risk, and grape seed extract helps treat Alzheimer's, according to Mount Sinai Medical Center staff. Western medicine has saved my life. I can't say anything bad about it, but chemo is tough stuff. With science on her side, Linda's now cooking up her own combo of old and new treatment. Taking action for your health, I'm Linda Hurtado, ABC Action News.